Milton, can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep, there's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Now, lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Fine. Good. That's it. Well, that looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Son. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Uh, come on! Move! Uh, oh, oh, oh. 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 Oh, shit! I'll get him! Get a rope on him, Milton, and try and calm him down. I gotta build that. Bad ball. Now, where are you going? He's up. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh. Gotcha. 
easy. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. You need to calm down. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. There, there. There, there. Whoa, there. Whoa, there. Easy, easy. You're an angry one. All better? Okay. <laughs> now, come on, you hunk of Chuck. Stubborn, ain't you? <laughs> Let's go. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How fancy pants get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, come on, get him! Come on, get him! Oh, kick his head in! Ah. Come on! Oh, boy! Getty spins on women, saves oh. on hands. It's guy. like that, huh? Oh, he's licking you, boy! Cause you're tough. It's cause you're stupid. Oh, oh, oh. You need help? Yeah. Oh, no. Jim, get off that man! Get off him. He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life, married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Uh, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> 
Yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. What the hell was that? What are, you, what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Jim, you gotta do something. Two of them are about to stall. They got Tom. It's a rich man's father. Hey, you boys. Who's this? New hand? <laughs> Dub <laughs> Hicks, brought this on your sails. I'll be up in a moment. You shouldn't have crossed the land, kiddies, now. That's my wind. He's out. They've killed Mr. Tolbert, and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I sir. guess we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim, I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Me in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah! Yeah! Right! <laughs> Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. Couple guards out front. Couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah, there's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. coming up to Pronghorn. I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough. Come have a word with me. You here to cut a deal? You're too late, partner. I'm here for our cattle and to teach some manners to... Love you. <laughs> you seen how many men we got? As many as money can buy. Now get out of here, Hayseed, before you get a hole in your head. Just shoot him!
loot. You're gonna be sorry for what you've done. You're gonna... Where are you, big fella? Piss-sticking, shit-shoveling, backwoods, sacker, no good, trash. That woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes first in sheet dip, get the stink of you off of. Good girl now. Mr. Milton, this man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. We'll do. Uh, well said, and thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. Uh, I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Look, just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. 